Hello everyone, and welcome back to Stream of Consciousness. I am Game Guy, and Buzzboy is with me again. Hello, everybody. It's again. Alright, um, we're gonna try to do this pretty regular. I don't know how frequent we can do it. Um, one suggestion I'm just putting out there for everyone, if you all like to send emails or questions to either buzzboy88 at youtube.com. Or give us some ideas for a talk show, you can or send us no, PM. Not ideas for a talk show. Uh, Things idea. to talk about. Ideas for topics. Excuse send us me. emails, questions. Sorry. Ask if I have a girlfriend, because I don't. Oh, shut up, you. I'm sorry. sorry <laughs> chick magnet. That. Sorry. Yes, I am a chick magnet. Crazy chick magnet, but a chick magnet. Anyway, let's start. Let's start. Well, yeah. Um, me and... Me and Game Guy were discussing before we turned on the mic. Um, Dark Knight. Some are on oh, Dark Knight and some of our worst favorite movies. Worst favorite movie. That doesn't even make sense. Worst favorite. That's a good title for something. <laughs> worst favorite movies. All right. I love that title. Well, anyway, if that title was a woman, I would let's finish up horrible this. things. All right, let's finish up Dark Knight. Well, Dark Knight, I would actually have to give it a ten out of ten because I thought it was a really good movie. Out of ten, and a mix and a mix of a mix of humor and sadisticness and darkness of the movie was actually really good. I'd give it a six. A six out of ten. Six out of ten. And why do you think that? I, I just thought it was good. <laughs> thought, thought parts were good. Thought the overall storyline was oh. a little. Morgan Freeman and his magical cell phone machine. But you have got to admit, the one thing that we thought was hilarious was when we were doing, well, when we were in the theater, every time the Joker made a sadistic joke, everyone in the theater would just laugh his at him. His sister was crying. His sister's a sick bitch. <laughs> She's crazy in the head. She was cracking up laughing when the Joker did the pencil trick. Alright, now we did Alright, now we've given our reviews of Dark Knight. Yeah. Oh, we forgot to do Clone Wars. Yeah, we did Clone Wars last time. Alright, so, now we're gonna go with our worst movies. Alright. You start. Josh? You begin. Alright. My worst favorite movie, uh, I don't even... It's called Revenge of the Red Baron. It stars Mickey Rooney, Tobey Maguire, and the girl from Saturday Night Live. I do not remember her name. Lorraine Newman. She was in Cone... Uh, she was the daughter from Coneheads when it used to air on Saturday Night Live. Oh, yeah. Anyway, um... <laughs> the guy played the... The pilot in World War, or Mickey Rooney plays the pilot in World War One that shot down the Red Baron, and the Red Baron comes back to haunt him in the form of a French speaking puppet. <laughs> this puppet does not speak French. This puppet speaks English with a French accent. That is so horrible. And kills people in a little tiny wooden plane. That's horrible. It is awful, horrid, horrid movie. Toby McGuire over axe. People get chopped up by a little toy helicopter. It's Mickey Rooney's stupid. like, why am I here? <laughs> right, who let me out of the crazy house? <laughs> it's an awful movie. One. And if you have a DVD copy of it, send it to me because I want to watch it. One movie that I, the movies that I think are horrible, I think everybody knows this, is the epic movie line, the date oh, movie line. Oh, yeah. That line was so horrible. These guys make this movie in a matter of weeks. See, I saw it part of Date Movie, and they, I wouldn't watch it anymore. They are poorly put when, when together. When I saw the commercial for Date Movie, I was like, oh, it looks sort of funny. Please. And plus, I don't know how they got Kevin Sorbo and Carmen Electra to do this. Well, look I mean, at who they are. Holy look at shit. Josh, Kevin Sorbo's career, if you didn't know him, Kevin Sorbo's of his show. Hercules. The Hercules, that was on during the 90s. If you didn't know who Carmen Electra is, then you are not a male. You're most likely homosexual. <laughs> I'm sorry to say, but yeah, and they made that. I wouldn't even watch it. I'm, I'm, I'm still. People have been trying to get me to watch Meet the Spartans. I'll usually watch any movie you put. No in front God, of me, please, no, man. No, I have to set restrictions. Once again, here I would have to definitely agree with the Spill.com ratings. This yes. is some old bullshit. Right. If you don't know what Spill is, go check it out. I said it last time. Yes, we are in love with Spill. Spill's an awesome site, if Spill was, If Spill was a woman, we'd... Yeah. Um, oh, please, don't go that far. I, I, I like to say that I like, perhaps, the, the glasses background we have. They almost look like Elvis Costello, Ben Fold's glasses. They look like your glasses. They are my glasses. See, I have very good glasses up there. Buddy Holly, <laughs> Elvis Costello, Ben Folds. If you can't tell, I'm a musical nerd. Another another movie that I thought was so horrible, even though I haven't even seen it, is Love Guru. Love Guru does look really bad. It looks really you bad. You thought it was going to be funny. I thought it was going to be funny at first, but then I looked at it, I'm like, wait a minute, it's so stupid. He does not have anything to say. 
There's a little movie called Strange Wilderness that came out last year. Oh, God, no. It's Steve Zahn. Oh, my God. Him and his sister were cracking up the commercials. They were like, we're going to go see that in the movie theater. It was in the movie theater. Oh, no. The only, no, the only thing it we... Was in, it's known and notoriously as the worst movie of the year. No. The one thing apart that movie that I thought that we thought was funny was The Shark. It was when it came up with the green thing, I would be going, oh, 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 They didn't even see that movie. They thought the commercial was funny. Well, but I can't say anything. My sister laughed at the Love Guru commercial, and I slapped her in the face. Another one of my mer- another one of my picks for worst movies of all time are pretty much any movies on the Sci Fi Channel. Yeah, them movies are so well, jo- Josh poorly put together. <laughs> there was Monster Arc on last week, which I thought was notoriously entertaining. Some some of them are actually good, but no, most, most of them Monster are bad. His arc it didn't have animals; it had monsters. Oh my and god. And he buried it and he survived, somehow survived 30 billion years. It was awful. I watched it all. Speaking of Ark, let's do, a, let's do another good movie review right now. Le- Indiana Jones, Raiders of the Lost Ark. Uh, I'm, I'm not a big fan of Indiana Jones. Fan. We're not. Yeah. This. Well, I like Star Wars a lot. Well, time. Indiana Jones and Raiders of the Lost Ark. I thought this movie was good. I didn't think it was great, it was good. Mostly, most, mostly I like the end where they opened the arc and the, and the guy's head exploded and the guy's face melted off. That was yeah. actually pretty funny. Yeah, well, it's a shame what happens at the end of Crystal Skull where Indiana Jones dies. Oh, come on. Don't don't put them at the edge like that. No, I'm serious. You haven't seen... Did you see Crystal Skull? No, I didn't see the Crystal Skull. Stand. No, he didn't. I'm dead serious. Shia LaBeouf picks up the hat and... No, I'm, I'm joking. Indiana Jones does not die at the end of Christmas. Oh, please. What kind they, of... Did they want to renew that franchise? They don't want to kill it off at one movie. I know, that sucks. Spoiler, spoiler, spoiler. <laughs> well, anyway, let's go back to bad movies. All right. Another movie I thought was a little... Was pretty damn bad. What? Was... <sighs> Step, Bro- Step Brothers. Oh, you saw Step Brothers? I haven't seen Step Brothers, but looking at it, it looks really, really dumb. Okay, he can't. He, he cannot review movies he has not seen. True. You, you never know. You might be surprised. Will Ferrell is a surprising actor. Yeah. I love Stranger Than Fiction. Stranger Than Fiction is one of my favorite movies. Oh, here's one. How about Talladega Nights, The Ballad of Ricky I Bobby? I thought Talladega Nights was alright. Well, Talladega Nights I thought was pretty stupid at start. It was actually... Eh, I thought it was dumb. Master Disguise was awful. Yeah. You, I'm going to be a master at the skies. I'm going to kill you. How about Blades of Glory? I like Blades of Glory. The Glory, too. Yes. Co- Blades of Glory. Blades of Glory. This co- summer, coming to a movie there. Blades of Glory. Yeah. Will Ferrell is killing the audience. <laughs> yeah, wouldn't that, of Glory. wouldn't that be hilariously funny, folks? <laughs> that would be... Where? Is Porky Pig all of a sudden? Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Porky Pig Daffy Duck. I'm a little bit of that time. Oh, you're the speckable. Alright, let's stop. Let's this stop is the that. Porky Pig Daffy Duck podcast show. Oh, please. Hey, what's up, Jack? Um, God, spare me right I don't now sound from like this. Peter Griffin. But, you know. No, if you want a Peter Griffin, you gotta hear my Peter Griffin na- impersonation. Go. Oh, cool. I, I don't. I don't do his voice. I can just laugh. Right, do it. <laughs> you know what, Jack? That really shocked. That really shocked. <laughs> Mine's a lot better. Oh, this shut is up, Buzz Boy. Here. Please, God, no, save yeah, me from this. Yeah. <laughs> uh, presidential you are the worst co-host I've yeah, ever yeah. heard. I'm, I'm not a big fan of Family Guy. Um, family Guy's actually pretty funny. See, everyone's gonna... It, you're gonna get some hate mail. I hate the Star Wars prequel and Family Guy. Again. How about... No. How I think King of the Hill and the Simpsons are much more sophisticated humor. Here, no. How, here's, a, here's, a, here's a definitely a bad movie for you. How about The Matrix? I like Matrix. Well, Matrix 2 has got awful. I'm there you go. The Matrix Revolutions is what I'm at. Oh, come on, Josh. What movie does Alex hate that you can always push those buttons with? Gremlins? Oh, I'm terrified of Gremlins. <laughs> I'm terrified of Gremlins. Everyone out there, I'm terrified of Gremlins, Clowns, and Needles. Come up to me with Gremlins, Cows, and Needles. I would run like a little bitch. Oh, and, and the musical Cats. I'm oh. terrified of the musical Cats. Here, here's one for you. How about Killer Clowns from Outer Space? I haven't seen it. That movie was horrible. Oh, yeah, I'm terrified of clowns. I won't watch that. I won't watch Stephen King's It. Oh, please. Um, How about Cabin Fever? That was actually... Eh. <laughs> pancakes! Pancakes! <laughs> if you no. don't know the notorious Cabin Fever pancake scene, go look it up. Because that move, that scene right there ruined that whole movie for me. Some little retard kid just wants pancakes and bites a guy in the nose, and then some redneck starts shooting at him. That's, oh. 
You know exactly what I'm talking oh, about. Oh God, right? man. Don't you? Yeah, I do. That's oh. Okay, good. We almost happened to happen to us again. <laughs> Josh, uh, game guys, screensaver keeps popping up. Well, we're trying every to do ten this. minutes when we're talking. So if he doesn't touch anything. We suddenly see the background from Star Wars blow up. <laughs> it's not supposed to be Star Wars. He's not that big a Star Wars fan. No, that's me. Buzzboy, I have a challenge for you. Name me one Mel Brooks movie that you thought was stupid. Oh, there's a lot. Of them. There are some Mel Brooks movies out in there that aren't that good, but we'll talk about that next time. So we only have about thirty seconds left. Um, so send us some email questions. Send send Tim because send, he'll read them. Yes, yeah, send I'll, me. I'll, I'll read them too. I, know, I got nothing to do. So, send us some, send us send, some email. Send me any comic questions you got, any Star Wars questions. And send me any questions about video games. Or Doctor or, Who, because it's awesome. Or just send us a topic to uh, discuss. So, yeah. So, this is Game Guy 3424 and BuzzBoy88 signing off. See you next Good time. Good night, ladies.